So while we get fitted just a little bit here, let me tell you a little bit about what's gonna be happening. So we today are gonna be studying a little bit of physics. Now I know physics always has this big, horrible sound to it because we learn about it late in school and stuff like that, but really physics is all around us every day, it's something very important, and today we're gonna look at gravity. Who can tell me what gravity is? I need someone to tell me what gravity is. Gravity, yes, what is gravity? It's that force that pulls you down. Very good. Yes, it is the force that pulls us down. It pulls actually everything down, including it keeps things onto tables, or if we drop it off the table is what causes it to hit the ground. So if you take a pumpkin pie and you drop it, it's gravity that causes it to hit the ground. Or if, say, for example, randomly we take a pumpkin, raise it 20 feet in the air and we drop it, that's what causes it to fall. But there's something else that happens, and that's called collisions. Can everyone say that big word? Collisions. Let's say it a little louder. Collision. Collision. All right, so a collision is when two objects hit. Now, there's several different kinds of collisions, but right now what we're dealing with is we're dealing with the collision between a pumpkin and the ground. And who's going to win in that collision, the pumpkin or the ground? The ground. The ground will always win in pretty much any kind of collision. So we are going to be dropping pumpkins from 20 feet up. Now, we could just drop pumpkins, but where's the fun in that? Really what we want to do is we want to explore collisions in a little bit more of a graphic way, and that is by filling the pumpkins back with pumpkin puree and or whipped cream. So we have two different liquids here. They will get to choose during their relay race which one they want to fill their pumpkins with. Go away. All the flies and bees are just so interested in what we're doing. So, as my scintillating assistant, Lauren here, was just demonstrating, they're going to run over here. They're going to take a spoon of whipped cream or a spoon of pumpkin puree, or if they're feeling really gutsy, a little bit of both, race back and put it into their pumpkin. In two minutes, they will fill their pumpkins as much as they can. At the end of the two minutes, they are going to back out of the way. I, again, for those of you who got these wonderful seats, congratulations. I don't guarantee that you are far enough away, so just kind of keep your eyes open. We are going to take the pumpkins, put them onto the lift, raise that lift up to just about the height up there. That's about 20 feet in the air or two stories. And then we are going to drop them into our pool. Our pool is filled right now with shaving cream. It's gonna be glorious. So if you have a phone that allows you to take slow motion video, I do recommend that. It's gonna be fantastic. Uh, so, are our relay racers ready? Hey, Everybody hey. ready? Let's try again. Are y'all ready? <laughs> we are very ready. <laughs> All right. So, I am going to just step out of the way so I do not get in the way. Our racers are ready. Again, guys, remember you can pick either whipped cream or pumpkin puree or both. It doesn't matter which side you're on. The goal is to get it back into your pumpkin. You will have two minutes. Uh, allow me, uh, do you have the timer? Stephanie, you have the timer? Uh, do you, you have the timer. Okay, there we go, sorry. We had to undistract our distracted person. There we go. All right, are you ready? Set! Wait, our one person who was ready earlier. Are you ready? There we go, got our arm free. Ready? Set! Go! 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 Cheer them on! Cheer them on! This is not easy work! Okay. They are making a pumpkin pie of their own, but inside a pumpkin. Go ahead, just go, go, go. Don't worry about getting it all off the spoon. It's about speed. It's about speed. Oh, Don't worry about cleaning the, the spoon pumpkin. off. Just go, go, go. Go, go, go. Do not hesitate. Go, go, go. Go, the go, go. Crowd, give some encouragement. Come on. Give some encouragement. Go, go, go. Huh? 
Yeah, we're going to drop them. You're not going to. No, you're not going to get to drop it. <laughs> nice try. There you go. That's awesome. Awesome. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Next person. Next person. Keep on going. Hey, buddy. Buddy, come on back. Come on back. We're not done yet. Where are you going, friend? Where are you going? Come on. Back over there. You got to get back at the end of the line so you can go next. You're going again. You may have to go again. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Do not slow down. Keep on going. Keep on going. How much time do we have? One minute. One minute. Feel the urgency. Whoa. You all right? You did it, Coral. You all right? Let's see. All right. You did good. You did good. Yep. All right. You did good. All right. Big round of applause for Coral there. Big round of applause. Let's keep her going. Twenty seconds. Twenty seconds. Go, go, go. Don't slow down yet. Go, go, go. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Five, four, three, two, one. Last scoop will go in. All right. You got it. There you go. All right. Last scoop in. All right. Thank you all. All right, big round of applause to our racers. Let's see what we got in here. This is, oh my. Oh yeah, okay, this is looking really good. I think we're gonna have a phenomenal time here. So, the one thing I neglected to mention is of course, what y'all win, do y'all know what you win? It's not a cash prize, I'm so sorry, it's not a cash prize. Today, by contract, my scintillating assistant, Lauren, is gonna let them Pie her, whoever wins will get a pie to her. As well as you get, a, you get a, you'll, you'll get a special prize also. But most importantly is that you'll get to pie my scintillating assistant, Lauren. Lauren, take a bow. That you're so excited about. You can tell how excited she is. This is what happens when you sign your contract before reading the fine print. All right. So I'd now like to introduce a gentleman right over here. This is Mr. Gary Schott. He is not normally seen by our audience, because he actually works in our fabrication shop. He leads all the work. So all the things that you see in the museum that you've gotten to play with today, that's him and his team. Big round of applause for Gary, please. They do a lot of good work. All right, so what we have right here is we've got a test pumpkin, Gary, for you to take up. If you, yep. We have Team Two's pumpkin, woo! And Team One! All right. We're gonna do the test one first. So Gary is now going to go up about 20 feet in the air. I am gonna get clear. I'm gonna ask everyone to kind of step back here. and We're gonna grab these tables and get them out of the way. And you know what? I think we need a little more extra in here. And a little something extra, extra good in there. A little, uh, hold on. Gary, are you ready? Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready? Team one, are you ready? Team two, are you ready? All right, Gary, the test pumpkin, because Gary needs a little practice here. This is a little hard. 
All right, here we go. Test pumpkin. Enjoy the shot, everyone. Go. And now you know exactly how far the mess is going to go. All right, team one. Do you think that your pumpkin will do better than that? All righty. Do we want to pull some of the chunks of pumpkin out? Let's get them off to the side at least. There we go. All righty. <laughs> this is just a delight here. You're going to have a little uh, pumpkin on your microphone when I give this back, fair warning. <laughs> OK, are we ready? All right, team one, this is your pumpkin. Put countdown, five, four, three, two, one. Woo! All right, everyone remember that. Capture it in your memory because you're going to vote whose pumpkin was better. So remember that moment. Everyone got it? Everyone remembering? All right. It is, or do we want to add a little more or are we good to go? Okay, team two, are you ready? Are you excited about your pumpkin? You think you'll do better than that? <laughs> We have a little doubt here. All right, let's do a countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. Wow. I think that did pretty well, I got to say. All right. So, audience, I am now going to pull out my handy dandy phone, which happens to have on it a handy dandy decibel meter. Now, for those of you who don't know, a decibel meter measures volume, how loud you get. So how loud you get will determine who wins. So who says it's team one? Shout loud. Not bad, not bad. How about team two? Wow, okay, let's do it one more time. Team one. And team two. And the winner is, with 106.9 decibels, which is really, really loud. My watch already sent me a warning saying that was too loud out here. So, team two. Team one, you get a wonderful prize, so do not go anywhere. Team two, come on over here. We are going to now get your grand prize. So this is, no, 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 y'all stand back there. Stand back there. Here we go. You can't go that far away. These are just kids. Come on. All right. So we are going to have y'all, so you stand right there. Perfect. So, your prize is you get to throw a pie at Ms. Lauren. This is my scintillating, can you all say scintillating assistant Lauren? There we go, there we go, I love this. All right, here we go, one at a time, we're going to see how well y'all can get Ms. Lauren with your pies. Here we go, ready, go ahead, walk on up and get her. Go on, go ahead, one, go, go get her. All right, there you go. Okay, you go up a little closer if you want to. Oh, there you go. Good job. Oh. <laughs> oh. All right. Oh, very nice, very nice. I've been giving a pie also. Um, they, they got y'all pretty well. Let me see here. Oh, no, they completely missed your back. I'm so sorry. Here we go. <laughs> All right, big round of applause to our winning team. Big round, special big round of applause to Ms. Lauren and Gary. We appreciate all you coming out today. We, For those of you who have your children here, we are going to send them out right back over here, mostly clean. Thank you all so much for coming out for the pumpkin chucking today. Remember, we'll be doing this again next year, so make sure to come on out. Thank you all so much. Have a wonderful rest of your day and a really great Thanksgiving.